CW decoder works pretty good on the uh, Shagu X 6100. Um, what I've noticed, and this is just maybe this is just my experience, but the uh, I'll find something to point with. I think this is the uh, I guess the audio passband that it's looking for uh, for decode, and uh, I found putting getting the peak of the uh, signal you're trying to decode right on that red line there um, which I believe is the actual tone that you set because if you change this tone that line will move um, depending on where you put that uh, the tone that you're uh, uh, looking to hear the signal at so um, I find if you get that peak right about there on that red line this uh, farther left of red line that it will actually decode pretty well and I've played around a little bit with the uh, the rate speed the uh, CW speed and um, if I'm not getting a de good decode I just adjust it a little bit and um, it seems to work okay if, if you're listening to some really fast code obviously turning it up uh, turning the speed up a little bit seems to help um, but it works it works well sometimes it uh, like you just saw there it uh, throws out a whole bunch of words that decoded over the last you know, several seconds instead of uh, doing like a real time it seems to I don't know I don't know what the word would be I guess buffer the some of the decode um, text before it kind of just uh, spits it all out there but now that you know it, it's a pretty effective uh, CW decoder I'm pretty happy with how it works and this is a uh, somebody running some pretty good code I'd like to try to find someone running uh, uh, running a straight key. Uh, I can get on uh, closer to the uh, uh, Straight Key Century Club SKCC group uh, running. They're usually, I think, on 20 meters, they're on 14.050, you know, 050 to 060. Uh, if I can, I'd like to see how the decode does on some of that, on some of their sending. A lot of those guys send some very good. Uh, very good CW and they have great fists um, but I'd like to see how it does on uh, someone that you know maybe maybe has a, uh, a little bit of timing uh, differences or irregularities that'd be kind of interesting to see so anyway thanks for watching